Hi there guys, this is Nikhil from Greedy Tech. In this video, I am going to show you how you can use WhatsApp on your Windows PC. Earlier, we were able to do that using the browser, but now WhatsApp has released a desktop client for Windows PC or even Mac. So guys, firstly, you need to come to this particular website, whatsapp.com slash download, and you don't need to worry about any spam or any malicious software. This is the official website of WhatsApp and this is the official software released by them. So firstly, download this software. If you're on Mac, download the version for the Mac or else if you're on Windows, just download the software for the Windows version. So you will be able to use your WhatsApp account from your phone. It doesn't mean that you will be able to create a new account using your PC. So let me just download that and I'll come back to you once it is done. So guys, now we have downloaded the file. Let me just open it up. Now open WhatsApp application on your mobile. Press the menu button or the three dots on the top right corner of the screen. Select WhatsApp web. Now select plus. And now point your camera to the screen. Now you'll be able to access your WhatsApp account on your phone, in your PC using the WhatsApp application. An interesting new feature is that we can add multiple WhatsApp accounts to the same desktop client. So just press the plus button over here. So on the left, we have all your previous chats. To start a new chat, just press this plus button over here and it will give you a new chat option. We can search through all our contacts over here. We can change the current WhatsApp profile from here. We can create a new group. We can start a new chat. We also have these nice shortcuts. And finally, we can do all the basic stuff that you can do on the app right from your desktop application. By the way guys, we have the applications both for the Windows and for the Mac and if you don't want to use this particular application, you can always use the web browser version. So for that, just go to web.whatsapp.com and once again, just scan the QR code and you will be able to use your WhatsApp account from your browser. As you have seen, once I have opened the WhatsApp application in the browser, I am not able to use WhatsApp in the desktop client. So at a time you can only use WhatsApp from one location. If I use WhatsApp on my mobile, I won't be able to access it from either the desktop client or the web browser. By the way guys, we didn't install any application, we just opened it up and it just created a shortcut for us in the desktop. So let me just close WhatsApp for now. Now let me use this shortcut and it just checks and when we open it for the first time. If you have already signed in, it will check if your phone is connected to the internet and if it is, then it will give you access to your chats. By the way guys, this software doesn't check if your phone is on the same Wi-Fi network or not. So if you have this application installed or configured on your desktop which is not password protected, then anyone in your home can check out your WhatsApp messages and contacts if your phone is connected to the internet. So do keep that in mind. So that's it guys, thanks for watching this video. I hope you found this video to be helpful. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up and share it with your friends and subscribe to my channel to see more videos just like this.